Hi everybody, I'm Shauna. This is Ring of Light Crafts. Welcome. Okay, we did a video not too long ago. Oh, literally just a few minutes ago. And with the leftover paint, I'm going to go ahead and do this one. I put down red this time as my background. And it's pure red, no Banksy, no nothing. And then I took my tissue, as you just saw. And I just picked up some of the stuff. I guess somebody's outside. Sorry about the dogs. Uh, then I just picked up some of the paint. So what we're going to do this time is we're going to go ahead and... Oops. Sorry, let me get this out. Tell you what color we're using. We're <laughs> stuck to my hands. We'll use yellow, red, white, blue, all color mix here, all silicone, and a little bit of water. Just tap water, guys. It's fine. At least that's what I'm using. And sometimes bottle. And clear um, glue, okay? Now what we're going to do is this time I'm just going to go and have some fun with it. What do you think? Let's just have some fun with it. Who cares what it does? We are actually going to go ahead and we're going to take our yellow. Let's pour it on there. Oops. Good enough. Set that out of my way. Let's go ahead and take some blue. Alright. It's kind of, oops, kind of a light blue due to the fact of the mixture that goes into this particular one here. It's kind of really just kind of sucks all the way around because I don't have pure colors yet. My mixture is on the way for my pure colors, so. though. We got red, so let's use our white. And you know, I'm not going to use the green. Add some white to here. And add some more white. A little there. You know what? Did I use? I did use all my pure colors. You know what? Let's go ahead and use the green after all. Just to give it a little extra, I'll try to go real slow this time. A little extra color in there. Okay, I'm out. I'm hitting my hand. That's why. But that's okay. And then what we're going to go ahead and do, get that out of my way. I'm going to take my yellow. And right down to I'm just going to add some more yellow because we really did not get a lot of yellow through here. I just want kind of to even out. Now we can go ahead and just get it to run. A little here, a little there. Our white is going to be very dominant. So I think we may just go ahead. Let's just get rid of some of that white and bring it over here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and pick up our red. Because even though once we do our little torch, we still may not have a lot of the red left. And now, uh, and we are still gonna have more of this yellow. Might as well use it up. Anything left will go back in this mixed container. Okay, let's just do this. Let's just kind of mix it a little. Get it to spread. All right, nothing fancy, you guys. Real simple. But now we all gonna do a swipe. But you know what? Everybody use top to bottom. Why? Let's just have some fun. We're not after nothing great. Let's just have some fun. Let's just take it off. Just go around and around and around. And let's see what it does. As you can tell, we are already getting some beautiful colors mixture here. And let me get some tissue from my hand here. So we're getting some beautiful cells is what I'm trying to say. Some color separation, that's awesome. I just love how that works. I want so bad to tip it to you so you can see it, but if I do that, you're gonna lose it all. But maybe I can move my camera down. Just enough. Watch your beautiful eye. Oops, sorry guys, I didn't mean to go that fast. Okay, there we go. So now we can see this. And we already swiped it. The only thing left to do is use our torch. But let me bring you guys up in oval. Just so you get a better look of what it's starting to look like before we use our torch. You can see we got some huge cells 
some nice mixtures turning into other colors. The green did really nicely there. I just love the different type of swords. You don't have to just go from middle to top or middle to bottom or top to bottom or vice versa. You just go on there and just move it any way your heart desires to do it. Okay? This is what you want to do. So, our next step, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and get our torch. Uh, once again, um, always make sure it's on safety and unlatch, which I already unlatched it. And it's turned on. And let's see what we can make out of this. A little bit of heat. And look at those cells coming. Now we all know I have a tendency. Let me do it my left hand. To catch sparks. So we're going to see if I can actually not do that this time. Live and learn, right? As you can notice, I'm getting my voice back. So I'm hoping to actually leave this with my voice in it. I will listen to it and see how horrible it may sound. I know it's still pretty sore. Been without a voice for almost two months now. And this is actually my very best day. How long this will last? God only knows. You guys look at these amazing cells. Let's just bring it up here. It's the only spot I don't have a good cell. Okay, I'm going to try to make a good cell right here. Well, I don't make the cells. Obviously, just add the heat. All right. Now, I'm going to lock this. I'll set it right here. I want to pick it up and show you, but I'm going to bring you to them. So once again, watch your beautiful eyes. Look at these amazing cells. Uh, we're going to be doing some other type of um, pore painting here soon. i um, going to give my voice just a little longer to recover. Maybe we'll do it next week. By next week, if I'm not well, there's something wrong. <laughs> um, look at these. I love this red right through here. That is just awesome. So once again, you guys, I hope you like this tutorial. Uh, once again, I want to thank everybody for the kind thoughts and prayers that I received um, through all kinds of social media outlets. Um, I really hope you like this. I hope you get to try this for yourself. If you don't have a torch, use a hair dryer. It's probably safer anyways. Not saying it is, just maybe. Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. And as always, be blessed.